Okay, what we got here today is Persia. Um, what units you can use to beat Legend Soli. Um, all the videos are done. So let me show you what I have for you guys. Okay, all the units you can beat Legend Soli with. You can use your Spara. He will work. Um, fully upgrade him, of course. He's just not upgraded in this tree. Your pikeman will not work. You get a ballista spam. The newest video I have out is with the immoral camp. And I'll show you what I use on them. But fully upgraded, of course. But they will work. Uh, Bowman, ballista spam. Never tried them. I just thought they wouldn't work, so I never even attempted it. All these cavalry units work. Um, I think the best unit to do Legend Soli would probably be your horse archer. They kill cavalry very well. You can use a pure ragged unit like a Gastro, as there's a video out there with them. And maybe one or two pals, of course, to kill buildings, but they have enough power behind them to kill any cavalry and then of course your gastro can take care of infantry and even other archers the war wagon is very useful um, I don't use range gear I use um, the bow that gives you bonus arm uh, bonus um, attack against infantry I'll show you that here in a minute but so quick rundown your Spara, Moral, all three cavalry, and your War Wagon are the units that can beat Legend Soli. The ones that can't are the other three. I don't count the Rams. I mean, come on, who really does? Just a quick note: you do get you get no bonuses from your ships for per for Persia. Now heading off to the gear that I use. I use for my Spara's pure health all the way, as you see, and then a Ramsey's, um, which I have further down. They're just not on this unit at this time. Uh, Immorals, Sword of Memes. Uh, there's a video. Safe Base says that this sword is garbage, and you should use the one that um, gives you 40% more health. Maybe that's true with this sword alone, but with what the combination that I have, this unit is pretty unstoppable. Um, when it comes to arrows, this is tricky. You're only going to get one shot off, no matter what. With no matter what you do, um, so even with the range arrows you're usually only going to get one hit off. So you want, you could think, you could do um, different arrows for more damage, but part of me says keep the range arrows so you can actually um, hit the ragged units a little better so you don't have to get closer and get hurt. Um, you could use anything for your fourth, fourth slot anything from the boots to the cheaper gauntlets to anything training speed okay, you don't need training speed and I'll tell you why here in a minute my god that'd be crazy but anything will work Ramsey's of course are there I use this armor now you can use the other armor but this armor works very well it gives you the cavalry bonus and the infantry bonus um, if you want to use the other armor, it'll stack the sword and the armor together. So if there is a map out there that you want to kick butt on infantry, even better. Um, we'll move on. We'll skip those two. For this unit, I can't pronounce it, so I'm not going to try. Sword of Means also. I use Spartan Shield for them. I find they need a little more health than anything because they are a weaker unit so I give them more health um, and then of course ragged armor 
and there's 34 gauntlets on here, but I'd use Ramsey's. In my video with War Wagons in this unit, my co-op, no, he did not use this gear, okay? He used um, the gear that you get that gives 100% cavalry bonus. So the shield, legend shield that gives cavalry bonus, and the horse armor that gives cavalry bonus, and then, um, man, I don't remember what he used for a horse. Uh, I think he used Greaves, Epic Greaves. I don't remember, so I can't recall. Okay, I don't have any of the gear on the horse archer right now, but I can tell you exactly what I use for the bow. Oh, here it is. This is the bow I use on the horse archer. Okay, plus legend arrows for range. Then this horse armor, and then Ramses. Uh, the cataphrat, heavy gear, heavy spear of Gil Gilgamesh sometimes, and where's the other one? Here we go. This one I prefer to use because it gives the cavalry bonuses. Um, it's up to you, but I prefer that. And Ramses and Saragani again. War wagon. This is not what I normally use for legend, um, but I like it for range, 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 and I'd use this bow instead. Of course, you can do it with paladins, but that's stupid to me, so I don't do it. Okay, just a quick something to show you guys. We're going to go back to the tr Immorals can be trained very, very quickly. I think they're the fastest unit in the game that can be trained. With this upgrade, Okay, that's 60% off the speed, plus with that, they train at 5. Now if you put an epic training sword on there, I bet you, you can bring it down to 4. Um, that just gives you an idea how fast they can be trained. I still have the stuff on here from the last run I did. But when it comes to advisors, it's the usual suspects that you'd normally use. Um, if you have the infantry, got two infantry, you use that. If not, you use that. That really never changes. Yeah. Train speed. Train speed. And that's what I use. If you have any questions, feel free to ask anytime. You know where to find me. Bye.